Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So on the channel, we've been talking about Microsoft clamping down um, on all the hardware that will not carry support for version 24H2, which is this year's um, annual feature update. And some old processors that rolled out about 15 years or so ago, 32-bit processors without pop CNT population count and SSE 4.2 without those two instructions will not be able to run Windows 11 version 24H2 and I'll leave one or two videos in the end screen if you'd like some more info. Now it seems that if you are running an old ARM PC that it will also not be able to run Windows 11 24H2 and this was spotted by Xeno over on X. So starting with this year's annual feature update the OS requires ARM version 8.1 to run and if we have a look at one or two posts by Xeno over on X yeah, we can see that an attempt to boot um, it from a device with an ARM version 8 based processor uh, just gave system crashes. So this is the old um, Lumia 950XL with ARM version 8. So the system crashed and was not able to run uh, previous insider builds that carried features and components of version 24H2. Now, so what we can basically sum up from this is that um, Windows 11 24H2 will require a minimum spec of ARM version 8.1 to operate. And fortunately, though, that will exclude devices sold from 2016 up until last year. So we're looking at devices that predate 2016. Now, um, if we have a look at this screenshot, um, here we can see that Xeno was trying to boot some previous Windows Insider builds, starting with uh, build 25188, which also resulted in a system crash. So Microsoft once again clamping down quite thoroughly on um, CPUs that don't support Pop, C Pop CNT and uh, the SSE 4.2 instruction. And also now those older ARM PCs which predate 2016 that are running ARM version 8. So you're going to need about ARM version 8.1 to be able to run Windows 11 version 24H2. Uh, so thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.